Hi Clout Chasers, welcome back to my channel. Happy Sunday. We are here for the Secret Sale Sunday. So this is your girl Mousy, and I am the ultimate SL Clout Chaser. Now we are at Gimme Gotcha Stores East or Gimme Gotcha Shops, I should say East. The coordinates are Gimme Gotcha East, 159 comma 116 comma 22 I give that to you in case you're at your browser and you're feeling a little lazy and you don't want to look for a teleport you can just type it all in so again that's the gimme gotcha shops hyphen east comma gimme gotcha east parentheses or what are those brackets called the rounded brackets guys 159 comma 116 comma 22 so anyway we're at the secret sale headquarters I'm just going to call it Secret Sunday Sale, guys. I like the way that flows better than Secret Sale Sundays. And here's an event that lasts for like 24 hours, we should say. So this usually comes out around midnight Sunday and then SLT time, of course, and then it'll last through 11.59 p.m. in the evening SLT time. So SLT time, it is currently 8.39 in the morning. For me on the East Coast, it's like almost noon it's like 11 40 and i usually do it around this time i was gonna film it last night since i was already up but i didn't want to inundate you guys with videos because i gave you like three videos yesterday your girl's been taking care of you i guess with this um self-quarantine i've been keeping myself somewhat productive with this hobby of mine so yeah that's what it is so it says every sunday at midnight we reveal a, a new list of creators offering an item from their store discounted to only 50 linden guys you better move fast because these discounts only last 24 hours you can get the hud here where i'm at and let me just briefly go in to the hud so i will say this do you necessarily need to join the group in this case no because the hud doesn't come from the notice section the hud actually comes from this location here once you're at the gimme gotcha shops each all you have to do is touch for the hud you accept it you go into your inventory and you go into your recents file and the secret Sunday sale HUD will be there. My understanding is that if you have the HUD once, it will automatically like load up to the week's gifts. But I'll show you how to join the group anyway. So give me a second. Cam back into my face for a minute. All right. So all you have to do is go into contacts, groups, search, secret sale sunday you type that in and then you have to toggle the members section and it's secret sale sunday is the one with 3050 members you open the profile you join the group and that's how you're part of the group it's kind of helpful because it's like a little reminder it basically says to you hey guys the sale is going on you only have x amount of time and then as it's winding down um it'll just remind you guys come shop come get your items come get your 50 linden items so that's where we are all right, so I have the HUD on. I usually have it on a little bit earlier to give it time to load. It takes like 30 seconds to load. So it says click here to load the latest listing. So we're going to click there. And then it says to scroll, use the side scroll bars on the or click on the list to enable your mouse scroll wheel. But we'll just click here. Navigate the shopping guide by clicking the arrows on either side of the image, um, either on the left or the right. If you do not see the arrows, please wait a moment and allow the guide time to fully load. I did that on camera. It doesn't take that long. And this dress is freaking hot. I like it a lot, guys. Anyway, this is, it looks like it's for Matreya only, which kind of sucks, but we'll go visit it anyway. So this is a date night dress. It is like a nice, slight cowl neckline, strappy back, short in the front. Um, it's sequenced and a little bit long in the back and it's from Novu and I kind of like it a lot so guys I know I was chatting a lot I'm gonna put um in the description from now on because in case I like talk too much I'll put in the description and let you guys know like when we start shopping and at this point it's what four minutes and 25 seconds so let me just write that down four minutes 25 seconds that'll be our marker so in case you guys don't want to hear me just chat so much so what I do is sometimes for the Secret Sunday sale, one of the benefits is the items are usually readily available. Like you can land in the TP spot. You'll see that beam, which either shows you where things are or it's like, or it's like right in front of your face. You've landed right in front of the item. So first of all, I love the two colors like this iridescent white 
and it, it has like shimmers of like uh, blues and pinks and purples. I don't know if you guys can see that, if that's going to come up really nice on the camera. But I, I love the design of the dress and I also love the color. So, and here it is in black. It's very beautiful. And I don't know, and it says date night dress. It's rigged for Matreya Lara. Unfortunately, it's not for all of us. And um, are these colors 50 linden as well? No, the other colors are 295 linden. So if you want it in pink, red, just stark white, uh, pink, uh, light pink, pastel pink, gray, or silver, and yellow, you'd have to pay $295. But for these colors, uh, black as well as, what color are they calling this one? hollow they're calling it hollow uh it looks more white to me you guys let me know but it's beautiful i love the color these two dresses are 50 linden okay so guys as a reminder um if you happen to like say gimme gotcha east for whatever reason is too full just go to one of the spots that you went to last Sunday, and there's usually a HUD there. So there's a HUD at every uh, creator or vendor who's selling items, okay? So just wanted to let you guys know that. Unfortunately, I can't buy this dress because, honestly, I totally would. I think it's super cute. Um, I've never been to this store. So one of the – another thing that's really good about, like, coming – joining this secret Sunday sale, I'm changing the wording a little bit, is that, you know, you get to visit stores that you've never visited before and just see what's out there on the grid. So this dress is beautiful. It's it's really gorgeous. And it would have been really helpful last night. So last night, guys, um, I was randomly TP to like some live concert. Oh my God, that concert was fire. The singer there was Say hollow dress we're moving on to the next item oh we're going to analog dog it looks like it's for hair so let's just hop over there right now and i may try it on for you so the singer was say um there was also a singer named sam she's a british woman she sang about three or four songs i hopped in and i wasn't dressed because it was like cocktail attire i'm wearing like hoochie mama cocktail attire but you know what i mean um and everyone was dressed beautifully the singing was magnificent. If we were in the building, it's the type of singing that would like rise up into the rafters. It was so beautiful. It was so angelic. It was just goals. Uh, I left the name of the venue down below and I also left Say's information and another singer Sam's information. So if you want to just join their groups or contact them in worlds, maybe for your weddings or your events that you have in SL, I would totally do it because like it was such a treat guys everyone enjoyed it all right so here we are secret sale and this is analog dog like I'm in the house cleaning up it's a messy ponytail day so I will try this hair on for you because I don't get to try on many out like many hairs and things like that for analog dog analog dog is like a part of every event that you could possibly think of honestly so I'm wearing the Doe Artemis hair, and I'm just going to take that off. Let me pluck my wig off right now. I'm going to save my outfit, too, so I don't have to. Uh, so save this as three. I'm sorry. I'm a New York guy, so if you hear the ambulance or noise outside, this is what it is. Like, I typically don't hear it. Nude gold crown. Burr. Like, this is how I name my outfits. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to pull off this wig wig be gone and this is a free gift from evie this crown so i'm gonna pull off the evie flower crown which i thought went really nice i think it's really cute and i am going to put this hair on from analog dog i've been meaning to try analog dog's hair for a minute now like for um you know like the saturday happy weekend sales and things like that and i haven't gotten around to it so let's see what this looks like all right, so the hair is flexy. It's very light. Is it too... Okay, let's let's back out a little bit. If this is a ponytail, I am trying on the right hair. It looks like a bob. It doesn't even look like a ponytail, guys. All right, so let me see if I can move this up. Let me play with this a little bit. So let me move my wig up a little bit. Okay. How does that look? It's, I moved it too far. Okay, let's move it back. Okay, let's see what that looks like. I feel like analog dog's hair. This is not terrible. So let's go into dark browns. But I do feel like their hair needs a little bit more stiffness. It's like a little too light, you know what I mean? But that's just me. 
I don't feel like this is the right hair either that I'm trying on that they gave us. So it's a Lilo hair. I, I just want all brown. No blonde. No blonde. All brown. Okay, let's see what this looks like. What do you guys think? It's cute. It's not horrible. Like, you just have to play with it a little bit. Mm, French vanilla coffee. Get the right hair base for it. It's not horrible, but... um. Mm. Yeah, it, it needs a little, it needs tweaking. Like, I'm not exactly sure. Let's rotate it a little bit and do more of like a side bang kind of thing. Yeah, I would rotate a little bit, maybe pull it forward, let the hair sweep over my forehead, uh, that sort of thing. But the hair is not awful, guys. So there we go there. There we go there. So there, that's what that hair looks like. If you guys like it, the back is a little choppy. And this looks like nothing like the ponytail. So I touched this demo and it's the Lilo hair. All right, so let's see if there's a HUD for styles and I, I probably need to push this wig back a little bit too. But let's see if there's a HUD for styles, but at least you get a, a feel for the texture of the hair. You get a feel for the wispiness and sort of the, um, like how the hair moves because it is flexy. So you get a feel for those things. All right, so we've done that. Uh, let's go back to the dark brown HUD. And what we're going to do is just say no bangs, bangs. Like, we're just going to change the styling a little bit. So we did bang one. It looks like a piece of random hair here. Okay. I'm hitting bang three. So bang three is a piece of random hair. Bang one is more hair to the front of the face. I'm going to remove that now. Bang two it kind of removes some hair from the front. Bang four. I, I don't know what bang four does. All right, but the point is you get to see the texture of the hair. Uh, I just showed you some color. You get to see the color of the hair, the haircut itself. I think this ponytail would probably look a lot better. That's for the Wanderlust weekend sale, but this is not the right hair for, yeah, it's too far up to. Let's wig. You guys would need to try this on and you would need to work on it to fit your face. It's not horrible, but to me, it's going to need a lot of work. It's it's not something that you could just put on and go. Like, you got to really work with it. I had to work with the unorthodox hair. So, uh, you know, it, it's part, of, it goes with the territory. But first of all, let's take this wig off. But this wig, if you put it on, it looks like you just like slept in it and then woke up and now you're going to the corner store or something. It takes some work. That's what I'll say about that. All right, so let me put my hair back on. I'll put my crown back on, and we're going to move on. Well, welcome, Analog Dog. It's nice to see you here. Uh, they, they're they hard workers. Like, they're a part of every event. Um, they're really trying to get their name out there. This romper is cute. It's from um, Amataria. I like it. All right, so let's wait for the sim to load up. It's cute. And then maybe we'll see what else they're selling. And it looks like they're also selling sleeves and a hooded cuffed hem sweatshirt dress. That's cute, too. That's totally my style. So you see what I mean? Like, in some areas, you land, like, right <laughs> on a person or in front of the item. So we'll just pull in and out and wait for this to log. I'll tell you, ooh, look how beautiful her dress is. And we'll see what body this is for and things like that. All right, so we have this kind of like athleisure wear outfit here, okay? We have a crop top with a zipper. This is for Matreya only. Oh, this sucks. Like all the outfits I actually like, it's for Matreya. It's this knit fabric that's tightly woven with a nice sheen on it. We have the lacing detail, one longer than the other, and a zip front crop top, uh, and it's a crew neck, so it's really cute. Then we have the matching tights, and it looks like it has slits at the knees, and these items are 50 linden each. Very nice. I really like that. Then we have um, a mesh romper jumpsuit. Unfortunately, this is for um, Matreya Lara only, which is very sad. 
because I like the, I would have bought the romper. In addition to that, I would have definitely bought the NASA sweats, sweatshirt dress, except I would have probably had it in gray and white and then rocked it with some sneakers. I think this is super cute. So the sweatshirt has some prints on it. You could either have the word NASA, you can have error, you can have uh, drama, no control, like all these wordings on it for 50 linden is a good price, especially when you have all these color change options and you have all the wording options because you could really make it look like a different outfit. Um, I would like it even more if all of the color of the sweatshirt was one color. I don't like the black colors. And then here are these optional like footless tights or footless socks. I, I am not that crazy about this. It has bows on the garter and um, different style options where you can color it white and have it red or you can have the garter and bow match the entire. It's not even really a garter. It's really bow. Well, anyway, you can have, it's a bow on the socks, it's like some nice detailing and, or you can have it all match, you know, the, the footless socks. So this is what it is. Um, this is the store name is Amataria. Uh, there are some group gifts here. If you want to join the group, and if it's free to join this group, because there's so many gifts here, I may actually, hold on a second. I may actually film a separate video about this because that's my thing. So let's go in here. But I, I'm going to be honest. I haven't done this because, like, I don't feel uh, groups. It's 150 Linden to join the group. So this is not something I'd make a video about. Even though they have so many, if the clothes are only for Maitreya, like, that's not going to appeal to everyone. But for my Maitreya body wearers who's watching this, please be advised, this group has tons of free outfits and shorts and socks and pants and dresses and all sorts of things for 150 linden if you join the group so that's well worth the price so i just wanted to put that out there so amatari again selling five items that we see here um two athleisure wear outfits and then one really cute casual romper it has long sleeves deep v-neck it's short it's drapey it's beautiful but all these things are from Atreya. that's the only downside we're not making things for other bodies okay so we have that all right, so let's go on to the next item. All right, we're going to Petite Maison, and I don't feel like we've had them at the Secret Sales Sunday before. So let's head over there and see what's going on and what other items they're selling. All right, so let's allow that parcel music. And here we've landed right in front of the item per usual. I love that. And hopefully we'll get like the land impact and find out all these other things. So I'm just going to go through the HUD really quick just to see what else they're selling. It looks like they're selling LED magnolia wreath and spring banners. So these are like all springy things for your home. And this is not Petite Maison. All right. So it looks like just this one item. All right. Just wanted to make sure I wasn't missing on anything. But where's the Saturday sale um, information? So I'm going to just click buy. This has 195 linen. All right, so I want to see your Saturday secret Sunday sale display. Okay, so trash chic. Where is the? Okay, there it is, guys. All right. Petite Maison looks like they have a lot of cute stuff. So I'm gonna put a star here because I'm in the process of decorating my house. So I need to know these things, like where I can go to buy like nice stuff. So I'm going to landmark this place for myself to shop later at, at my leisure. But we're going to stay focused on this video. So this is the spring banner. It's super cute. And then we have the wreath. It's a magnolia wreath. And in the middle, there are circular LED lights or LED lights that's lining the wreath inside. So if this is something that you guys want, it's only 50 lindens. You can come pick that up. It's not something I would buy. I don't like like... I'm not even going to get into it, but I don't like things that I have to change. Like, I don't want the extra work. Like, I don't want to have to change things after spring and summer. Um, I, I don't mind for Christmas adding a few things and putting it up. But, like, to change my whole decor of my house, no. But I guess that's one thing. I don't know. It's up to you. Tell me if you, how you guys feel about this. Oh, wow. This is a really in-depth teleporting system, hey? All right, so let's find out where the, okay, 
Okay, so it's right here, right? So what are you selling, babe? So we have the Secret Sale Sunday HUD here. Uh, there are tons of events, but where is your actual item? All right, so let's, the first thing I think we're going to do is go where the people are. They have tons of gifts too, guys. Does it cost money to join this group? I don't even know what they sell. So I see a lot of like signs and there's a party watermelon here. There's hot chocolate. Ooh, this is nice. All right, let's see if it costs to join this group. Oh, okay. So guys, it's free to join the group. Look at the world's maps. These are really nice decor items. Uh, the neon signs I could probably do without, but you know, if you're interested, there are neon signs that says unhappy hour. There's a popcorn machine here. There's a massage neon sign machine. There's like some autumn decor, uh, hot cocoa. I love this, the wines. It's like upcycled upcycled wine glass holder really like that um there is laguna sun catches the watermelon um party watermelon um gold and silver and black like compass sign date nights the gotcha garden gift get stuffed and there's just tons of group gifts here i love group gifts guys yeah, so check this out if you're interested. All right, now, stay focused. And there's another wall of group gifts as well. Okay, so I'm just going to zoom in this really quickly so that you can see. So there's a Dallas sign that says lunch. This looks like some Kingslayer <laughs> um, Game of Thrones type, type of situation. There's ice cream floaties and just fall signs and things like that. All right, so we're going to stay focused. We need to look for the Saturday sale item. And I guess they have Lysol in their hand. Okay, good for you, honey. Uh, where is the Saturday sale item? I don't see the beam or anything. Hmm. Okay, this is not good guys, especially if they're selling more than one item. So let me go back to the HUD really quick. Oh wait, there's Wanderlust. Yeah, where is the beam? Oh, this is, this is not Saturday sale like. I can tell you that right now. Oh, there it is. Okay, there's the beam. Yeah, but you gotta, this is not good. It's like really hard to find this item. All right, so anyways, let's wait for this to resin. And so it looks like they're selling um, a towel rack. And so we have these different, the textures are okay, really nice textures. We have uh, three sets of towels and a towel rack, and it could either be grays, variations of blues, greens, reds, and browns, and then these like blues, purples li lilac and purple so if you guys want this it's only 50 linden that was a lot of work for a vendor selling one item but they're new to the list and they have tons of free gifts so we're gonna forgive them so let's move on to the next thing next thing is rat cats wall clocks so let's head over there um there are a lot of new vendors like that i've never seen here before so let's check that out so teleport on the image to I don't want to just leave here, so, uh, is Rats Cats the name of the store? <sighs> okay, there it is. All right, because I was going to start looking for it. All right, so the teleport just popped up. Let's head over there. What is all this stuff floating in my coffee? It's like, it's coffee grinds. So let's allow... This is probably someone asking me for money. Yes. Big in. Brian. Sorry, I didn't see that. All right, so let's look for, uh, ooh, this greenhouse is nice. All right, I'm getting distracted, guys. It's so huge, too. All 
Um, she, he's just asking, do you get all the colors? The colors are the colors you get are in the set. Example, rays, rays, etc. Okay, so I just told him. So let's go back to what we're doing. Sorry about that. This greenhouse is 134 land impact. And it's really nice, guys. This is not what they're selling. Okay, so let me, let's stop. Let's go back to uh, where we should be. All right, and where should we be? So I was just complimenting the Secret Sunday sale because it was so easy to find all their items. And now the last two vendors I'm searching. But in fairness, they are new. So maybe they don't know that it should be a lot easier. It should be a lot easier. Okay. Okay, there it is. All right. So I see the HUD. This is the thing I recognize. So I'm like, okay, it must be close. All right. So here we are. It is easy. It's my fault. So these are the rat cat cat's clocks the cat clocks so the cat is like hanging on by their talons and these mini clocks in blue white or black is only 50 linden so if you guys are interested in that as a house decor item please come and get it that's what it looks like that's what the texture it's a little cartoonish looking but it's cute i've never been to this store before and this is one that i also want to landmark and just check out on my own and it says they are known for their lamps neon signs prefab building apparel clothing decor and they have gotchas shoes and heels they do a little bit of everything um yeah so i'm gonna check that out later on my own i just want to landmark this and you're not landmarking because sometimes like when I get busy in SL, like not busy, like say I don't have anything to do with my friends, you know, I sometimes just like tour around Sims that I've seen before and maybe didn't have a chance to like look at in depth. All right, so we're going to go to Circa and they're selling a botanical gardens potting table in light wood. So let's go check that out. It's from Circa Living. There are often items like this for sale uh, in the Secret Sale Sunday group. Uh oh, booty. Booty, 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 all around. All right, so I see the beam here. So I don't know if I just have to wait for this item to load. Yes. And they're selling tons of things, so awesome. So we get to knock out a few things in one visit. All right, so this is the Botanical Gardens Potting Table. Um, it's light wood and the table stacked with pots, plants, and tools. It's only 10 in land impact um, mesh, and it says that you can also transfer this item, okay? That's not usually uh, typical. Then we have the Botanical Gardens Hanging Flower Baskets in yellow. It's a set of two, three land impact each. Uh, mesh and it says you it looks like you can transfer it all right then we have I don't know if that's a RT Charlene hibiscus planter set in violets um, it, the design details has four items it has six, six stone pot colors via the touch menu. One version includes animated butterflies. The butterflies are here, guys. And it's six natural pot colors via touch menu. We talked about that. And it's two and four land impact each. So I would assume maybe the smaller one is two land impact each. And then we have the spring ottoman and violet. It's the Jolie. And it's tufted ottoman with, does it have animations? With 20 set animations. And it's only two land impact. So that's quite lovely. Any more? Ooh, more. Okay, and then we also have the design details in two parts. Um, it's a spring bench and striped heel, and it comes with, it's a gossip bench with nine, uh, nine feminine sit animations. Why the women just have to gossip? So it's like you're on the phone talking with your girls. The phone rings with, uh, with sound on touch and it is a modifiable, modifiable picture frame so you can put your own picture frame in it that's kind of cute um the bench is six land impact the frame is one land impact um and it's mesh and transfer item that's kind of cute um then we have the spring chalkboard it says do more of what makes you happy with crocus flowers and it's three and land impact and it's mesh and transfer so that's what we have here at circle living we have quite a few items for 50 lending so if you're home and self-quarantine and you want to like zhuzh up your house a little bit and you know just freshen it up like here are some items you can do that with 
like maybe you've been in SL a long time and you have more prim items, like this would be a good time to replace some of those items if it's in your style aesthetic and um, just update it. All right, so we're going to head over to um, check out this Talia bodysuit. Talia's hair is so voluminous. I love it. Okay, we'll wait for everything to load. We're at the hashtag district. Hashtag. And it says Enigma Apparel is the store. So let's check that out. I feel like I was here yesterday. Kind of weird. Oh, that must be a glass. I'm trying to walk through the glass. That's not going to be helpful. So Talia is a part of a lot of things because I see like there's a Midnight Madness situation here going on. Let's look at this. They're a part of the One Linden sale. They have uh, gift items they have let's check out the gift items they have events that they're a part of so the gift items we have a you know like a little dress this looks to be for Matreya um yeah I'm not I'm not too thrilled with some of these gift items like some of it's okay like this dress is okay but there's some dresses and like little club dresses dance dresses and um this looks like a i don't know what that is like kind of like a sweater a, a blazer outfit with a short skirt but if you guys like any of these gifts like come check them out all right so let's go back to what we were here for all right secret sunday sale they're missing the hud that i notice okay now let's check things out. All right, so the Talia bodysuit. So the Talia bodysuit is being sold by Enigma. It's from Matreya, Freya, Isis, Venus, Legacy, Hourglass, and Physique. It's a little thongy thong in the back. It's sheer. Um, it has a lot of, I would say it's not really lattice detail, but very similar to lattice detail. It's black, white, green. It comes in this sort of rose pink color, red and white. So if you guys like that and like how Talia is looking, she looks great in that. Go pick that up. Then we have this sort of like hippie outfit. Um, and it's, and is it just the top or is it the shorts? Because I think the shorts are kind of cute. So it's the Serona set. And so it looks like it comes with the top and shorts. I don't care about the top, but I do like the shorts. All right, I'm going to buy this because I like the shorts a little bit. I hope it looks good. I'll try it on so that you guys can see what it looks like. It's for Matreya, Freya, Isis, Venus, Hourglass, and Physique. I'll try both on. Uh, and the set may also come with the purse. And then we have some patterns here for um, the shirt and the top. And then patterns maybe for the bag. So we'll check that out in a second. And then we have this bell dress. Uh, it says three models, not included, cover sex. Uh, the models are not included. Okay, fine. So we have this dress in like a black leather, uh, brown leather, and this looks to be black to me as well, but I'm not sure what color they classify that as. And it's for Beleza, Freya, Isis, Venus, and then we have Matreya, and then we have Slink Physique and Hourglass. So if you want to wear this like little thotty dress, there it is for you. All right, so let me try this outfit on, guys. My shoes is not going to go with this because this is like a really cute hippie girl outfit. And I am wearing my hooker heels. So let's try this on. Let's see what this looks like. I'm just having some coffee. Alright. Alright, so I'm going to try on the hourglass top. I don't care for the top too much, but it's okay. We'll try on the top. And then I really want to see, and I'm curious about the shorts. And then we'll try on the shorts. The top comes with the purse, guys. Like, it's it's one in the same. There's no going around this. And we're going to get rid of my bouche dress, as well as the fur stole that I'm wearing. Oh, guys, this is kind of cute. It's not horrible. I love the shorts. What do you guys think? Okay, it's like it, it's weird because it's like the shorts are kind of like a pliers, but they're not. 
The shirt is a little stiff though, but I don't mind it. Like the shirt, it's it's cute as an outfit as a whole. And you guys know how I feel about purses and stuff because I have a lot of static poses and it doesn't go like I'd have to think about it, but it's not terrible. All right, so let me add, um, I'm going to change the shirt because I'm just curious to see what options there are. My shoes are pretty neutral, so anything will go fine with it. Let's add more of like a kind of like an African tribal print situation. That's cute too. And I'm just changing some of the HUD colors so that you guys can see. Oh, do I like this one better or the other one? And then like abstract art sort of situation. That's cute too. Alright, I'm just going to leave this one because I think I like the purse color better. And my arm is being covered by the static pose. That's the only thing. But it's not bad, guys. Like, honestly, it's really not. It's not terrible. I'm going to leave it with my heels too. It's not terrible, guys. Alright, so we'll leave that. The purse doesn't look as, like, um, high quality mesh. I'm going to be honest with you. Like, I wish we could detach the purse. But it's not horrible. I like the shorts more than anything. But we'll leave it for now. We'll leave this. If we find something better, we'll change it. All right, so there that goes. So thank you, Enigma. I actually bought something from you. I may change my mind about the HUD, though, the, the colors, because the purse. Yeah, so that's the Serena set, guys. All right, so now we're going to click over to get, I'm not sure what. It looks like a well, and we're going to the cookie jar house. I think the creator's name is Verona. Like, I had spent some time this week, like, going through her store and her location, um, and she had a lot of cute things. Like, there was a bed. So, Isabella Shireen did a, a interview with Strawberry Singh at Lab Gab, and she showed us her home, and there was a bed that was from this store. Uh, I'm not going to show you now because I don't know exactly where it is, but I seen it here when I came to visit individually. All right, so let's check out the cookie jar. Let's see what they have for sale. Well, I'll tell you the land impact and everything like that. So we're 37 minutes in, so I'm going to try like not to be as long winded as I usually am. Oh, I'm trying to close the HUD, but it's not working. All right, so let's zoom into some of the photos. I don't want to detach the HUD, but it, it may make me do that if it's still, if it's giving me a hard time. So many people here, that's why it's a little laggy. All right, so we have the DD Dreamland Designs Wishes Come True Fountain, and it's in PG, and this is what the fountain looks like. It says materials enabled, copy, modify, no trans. Now, just so that you know, in this particular store, all the items are going to be PG. If you want to buy the adult item, it will be significantly discounted, but I'll let you know what the prices are for that, okay, for those additional animations. Get out of here, HUD. Okay, I might have to detach this. Oh my goodness. This is really annoying, guys. All right, I'm going to TP out of here for a second because it's so laggy that I, I can't do anything. Hold on a sec. I don't want to detach it. I just really want to make it smaller. Okay, so I was able to make it smaller, like now let's go back. So we're going to go back now. That was really annoying. Now we're going to have to wait for everything to load again. It's okay. It's so laggy. Alright, so let's zoom in on this woman trying on some of the poses so that you can see what some of the PG poses look like. Oh, she's wearing a mask. I was like, why does she look so crazy? So these are what some of the poses look like. All right. So this is this is the wishes come true fountain. That's that. It's really pretty. Uh, I think the owner's name or the creator is Verona. Yes. Venera. Venera. Verona. Okay. Uh, you could touch the... Usually you could touch like these lighting items and the candle would go on and off. Um... 
So that would be item number one. The land impact on this is going to be 15 land impact. So we have that there. A lot of these items look the same, so I'm going to get a little confused. So if you want the PG version, PG version is only going to be 50 linden, and then we're going to go to the adult version. Please res for me. And everything's resed except for what I want. All right. All right. So it's 15 land impact. If you want the adult version, it's going to be 225 linden, which is not bad. It's significantly um, reduced price. Then we have the wild romantic garden scene. This is the adult. The PG is 50 linden, but if you wanted the adult version, it's only 250 linden. I do like that price. Um, and this is what it comes with. And both items will have the same. Swaying trees and flowers, running, can of, running water can, animated lamp and bird, single cuddles and adult poses. I do like this. I'm going to look at it live um, down below us before I commit to buying the adult version, but I think I'd prefer the adult version more than I would prefer the um, PG version, but that's just me. All right, then we have the Sp Spring Spirit Log Adult Set. It's for singles, friends, cuddles, adult solo. It's materials enabled, copy, mod, no transfer. So this is what it looks like. It's just like a tree log with a blanket here, some pillows, flowers, and a cute little squirrel. So this would go amazing on my land because I live like in a foresty type of environment. This is basically the same thing. The only difference is that there's a cherry blossom tree and there's a blanket here instead. So it comes with running water, single friends and couples, materials enabled, and it's called the Spring Spirit Lover's Black uh, Blanket. Uh, the adult is going to be 550 linden for this, and then the adult for the other item that I just, 350 linden. All right, so let's look at this now. Um, and then she usually has some upsale items. So the first thing I want to go to is the well, because I'm kind of like more interested in that for myself. I want to see it fully rezzed out. I need the whole vibe. I want to know what's going on. I know I said I wasn't going to buy any more like large items for my land because I already bought that pool from Trump Lowell, but um, I'm, I'm sold, guys. So let's sit here. And so that is not a female sit. This must be an adult, a male sit. So here's some female sits. Okay. I would just adjust myself to move up a little bit, but you know, cute standard female sits. Then we have some cuddles. You're sitting on Boo's lap. That's really cute. I like that. That's actually my favorite, uh, like cuddle stance. Like not this one. I think it was number. Was it number one? Yeah, number one's my favorite. I like that one. All right, so let's go back, and then we have some adult poses, and so. Um, you can go softer or harder. Uh, let's do a ride pose. <laughs> uh, let's go in. Let's see what else. Back. Okay. So for that's what it is basically for 250. Some nice sex animations. If you guys are interested in that. And uh, can we do anything with the well? Is it interactive? Let's see. No, it doesn't look like that. And there's the watering can and then the swing tree. Let's look a little bit more at the texture. It looks a little stiff, the tree, though. I have to be honest. Because there's another store that sells trees here um, and it's really beautiful. Hmm. Do we just want this in a cuddles version? And I think I would have this out, but I'm not sure that I would use the tree, especially this one. But I do like this other tree. So here's my dilemma. If you have sex furniture already in your outdoor space, you're because you know you don't really need to have every item have sex furniture, but it, it's fun though if it does. So this is the log with the blanket. That looks really pretty, guys. Let's see if we could change. Can we change the texture of the blanket itself? Because I see it, it looks like a shadow for the blanket, but I don't see the blanket. But the log is really textured and it's really nice mesh. We have the watering can. Uh, we have the little squirrel. It's really cute. And then we have the one um, with like sort of this rounded circular blanket. Uh, and that's nice as well uh, with the log. One is called like the spirit lover's blanket. And this one is called the spirit log blanket. They both have blankets. They look very similar to me. But you guys have to determine which one you like. And this is the well wishes. Wishes come true adult fountain. Let's sit here. Uh, okay, I see how this works because I was just wondering like how is this gonna work? 
So this is the lover's sleep pose, like, so you're just sleeping on the grass. It's cute. I don't know what to choose, because I kind of, I love the fountain. You know what? I'm going to get the PG fountain. Okay, what's cheaper? What's the cheapest adult? Because this is what I'm debating between. This um, Spirit Log Adult or PG, or but only one item I'll get PG version. One is going to be more like for decor, just hang out and sit around. And then the well. I do like the well a lot. So, um, guys, which one should I get? Wild romantic garden scene. The trees are what's like killing me about this because I don't like the trees that much. So the spirit lover's blanket comes with a tree, which I, we didn't see that one. So, um, so how much is this blanket an adult? The um, the log cuddle. Hold on a second. Let me just see that. Sorry, guys, I'm taking so long. I'm very indecisive here because I like it, but I just don't know what to buy. Uh, so if I get this an adult, it's 350 London. Um, and if I get this an adult, it's 250. All right. So this choice is going to be the 250 Linden. I'll just have to put my own trees out or substitute one of the trees. So I'll take that and then I'm just going to get the regular cuddle set for the wood because it's really cute and she does an amazing job. So that's 300 Linden in total. So that I, that's what I'll do. <sighs> you got me again. This is gorgeous guys. It's really beautiful, like really good work. I'm going to send her an email and, you know, a note card and ask her to do a giveaway for her channel. I think you guys would really like her stuff um, and maybe an interview so we could get to know more about her and her creative process. All right, so let's teleport to Nori. I think that's where we're going now. Let's check that out. Okay. We'll just wait for the stuff to load. So usually what they have is an, like every piece of an outfit here. Okay, sorry guys. This is the outfit that they're usually selling, like parts of the outfit, right? And they'll have every piece here for the most part. And then they'll have like the main piece as a discounted price, but you kind of need all pieces. So let's see what this is. So this is going to be Heldy uh, Log Band. We have the Heldy Wrist uh, Bands for 50 Lindens each. And then we have the Ankle Bands. And then there's a mystery box. So I'm not sure what's in the mystery box. So let me show you what this looks like on. So this is the wrist band. This would be the ankle band, 50 linden, 50 linden, and then, uh, I don't know if I needed to accept that. And then we have the armband, so the armbands are here, so that's what that looks like, right? And then they sell a mystery box. You have to open that on your sim. I did buy it once, so I, I don't know what's in the mystery box, so I can't tell you guys. But if you want the actual healthy outfit you'd have to buy that here on this wall and it's discounted to 150 linden so they still get like 250 linden for the entire or or more for the entire outfit but this is the situation at this store uh what is the name of this uh, Jen jenka so this is yeah they're here every week so they usually sell like some sort of fanta uh fantasy role play outfit uh it's usually like themed and you get all the accessories here for 50 linden and then you get the main outfit on the discount of the week wall so that's how that works so if you guys like it be sure to come pick that up all right so we're gonna go and get this niche skirt and black fur like okay so it doesn't look like the top is for sale. So let's check this out. Okay, we're at Atami. Atami. I don't think I've been to this store before either. All right, so this is the secret sale Sunday items. All right, what are we selling, guys? And they're selling two items. 
So this is the Niche White Fur Skirt. It does come for Hourglass as well as uh, the Niche Skirt and Mocha. So let's get up close. It looks like some type of, you guys are going to be mad for saying Korean. I know this is like uh, more of a European kind of, because their kind of sexy is a little different from ours. Can I demo this? I cannot demo it. All right, I'm going to try the skirt on in white, because I'm curious. I feel like it might look better in brown. I hope I didn't make a bad decision there, but uh, I want to try it on in white, because I feel like I could rock this and make it cute. Um... If it's a box, this is going to kill my whole vibe right now. All right, but I can touch. It's a bag, and I can touch and accept. All right, perfect. So let's try this on in Hourglass. Thankfully, it comes from my body. And let's remove the shorts. And so I'll let you guys see what that looks like. Okay, so let's see what this skirt looks like. And control shift Y, let's brighten it up so that you guys can get. I don't know if I like this, guys. It looks more gray, number one. I don't know what that line is supposed to be in the back. And um, to be honest with you, I don't know if it would look better in brown. So this is what the brown looks like, guys. It looks like some Korean panther outfit. I don't know. Uh, if you guys like it, get it. Uh, it's not for me. I don't, I don't know. Like, I want to know, how do I sell things that I don't like anymore? Is that possible? Like, if I don't like this and I want to give it away or sell it, because I don't want it just sitting in my inventory. You know what I mean? So, Nij, let's take this off. It looks gray. It doesn't even look white. It does look fur. It does look like fur. I mean, I don't know, guys. I don't like it. Did I remove the HUD by accident? All right, let's just go into the HUD. All right. So let's go back into the HUD. Hopefully it doesn't need to load up again. It does look like it has to. All right, so in the meantime, while this is loading and the arrow's coming up, I'm just going to walk around. I don't even know if I want to walk around the store because if you try something on and you don't like it, it's like more than likely you're not going to like anything else. So I'm just going to keep it moving. So we did all these items. We did quite a lot. We looked at this first skirt and white and brown but look this skirt looks like it comes in white it comes in mocha it comes in gray it comes in black where are all the colors the only thing I saw was white there hold on a second guys let's just go back where are all these colors that they're talking about so this is white and this is mocha uh, I'm just going to go into my inventory because I just want to check really quick. Not that, Because it could make a difference in a different color. So I just want to check really quickly. Yeah, it's definitely just the white skirt that I received. So I don't see all these colors that they're talking about. Maybe I'll let the creator know, you know. Because maybe I would have picked a different color. Probably not. I would have probably picked white. Because my idea was like to pair it with, like I thought it was going to be a fuzzy furry skirt. And then I could pair it with um, like a cute little crop top or something like that. And some fuzzy earrings. Like just make it up to date. I was thinking like a clueless type of outfit. Just like really cutesy. So anyways, here we are at Mystique. We're going to look at this gothic bench. It's black. It's five total land impact, 15 single poses, and 21 couple poses. So let's check that out. Um, it's at Bloom. And it looks like they're selling tons of furniture, guys. So let's move back a little bit. Give this lady some of her space. And then we'll look. All right. So... We have a corner bed holly. It's holly pink, 16 land impact, copy mod, no transfer, 12 single sits, 12, 20 cuddles, and 13 sex poses. So if you guys like the these this bed in a holly red, holly black, or holly pink, please be sure to pick that up. Then we have the gothic 
bench in red, we have it in gold. I wish I could see it physically. And then we also have it in black. It's five land impact total, 15 single poses, 21 couple poses, copy, modify, and no transfer. Now, what I want to do, guys, is I want to walk around because I want to just see what their furniture looks like so that we can get an idea of the mesh and texture quality. And I wish they had... It's like a little cartoonish to me. Does that make sense? I hope that's an apt description. Like, this is okay. This is okay. But some of it is, like, slightly primmy and... Um, it, it's okay when you come up close, but from this far, it looks like it looks like a little. F My issue is not even with the texture of the bed in this situation. It's more with the iron frame. I wish I could see this holly bed. What bed is this? This girl is staring at it all intently and stuff. Oh, I'm getting stuck. Oh, I'm laying on it. That's why. I did not intend to do that. All right. Let's see what this bed is. It's a boho bed. This looks like a homeless bed. No offense. All right. Well, this is, I mean, it's 50 linden. So if you're just starting out and need some furniture until you transition into something that you love, it's not bad. Let me just see what the price point is on this stuff, like in general, right? So let's see. The price point is $3.99 for a couch and it's $3.99 with sex animation. So 28 sex, 30 couple poses. So it's not horrible. Let's see what the bed is, just out of curiosity. So the bed is going to be 399 linden. Like a sex bed, like some a really good one that I saw at Fourth Wall is 600 linden and his beds are amazing. Guys, I've contacted him like to get on my channel and meet the creator series. So let's see if he responds to me. His beds are amazing. But like a Raj bed Beds like that go up for up to 2,000 linden. So, you know, we have to think about this. They're part of a lot of events. Uh, I see they're a part of like this 35 linden Sunday sale. And they're selling this ground cushion. I mean, for 35 linden, it's not bad. So I'll say that, you know, for 35 linden, it's not bad. And I think this is the cushion. But it's not the best either. That's what I'll say. It's not the best, but it's not the worst. So it's in the middle. So this, like, this kind of stuff is kind of cute. Like, it depends on your budget and what you could afford to do. 299 linden for the seating area. This one is going to be 229 linden for the swing bed. Again, this is another bed. 12 singles, 22 cuddles. I'm going to sit on it for a second. So I'm sitting on it. Um, these are some single animations. If you're in a, if you have a budget, and it is how many land impact? 19 land impact. So you have a budget. You have to watch your land impact. Now you have a bed. So female sit, female sit two. All right, and these are cute sits. All right, let's just go to the sex stuff. Let's go to sex. Sex three. <laughs> the only thing with some of these sex animations, <laughs> it's like, it, it's going to be with those sex animations where your neck and your ankles and everything's going to look a little weird, but it's fine. Look at this little kitten basket bed. Oh, so guys, look here, I found the bed. So this is the bed that they're selling. This is the exact bed that they're selling for 50 Linden, the corner bed holly bed. Uh, the corner holly, corner bed, holly black, holly red, and holly pink. Let me see if I could change the color for you guys so that you can see the colors. Oh no, because you have to buy it separately. So it's not even like a texture change bed. So this is what it is. It's not, it's not the best, it's not the worst. Like it'll, it'll get you by. It's definitely like a transition sort of bed. That's what I see it as. Like you're just starting out, maybe you're new to SL, this is where you could buy furniture. I think I'm do a series like that like you're new you want to buy furniture like you don't have 
the money to buy the absolute best? Like, what are some ways to shop to save money and to feel like you're like in the game and have everything that you need until you have everything that you want? Yeah, so I'll totally do that for you guys. So anyways, this is what was available here at Mystique Bloom. All right, so we're going to Evelyn in the box next. They're always here. And she always has some, like, fancy dresses that she's selling. So Evelyn in the box is selling two dresses. And I'm going to ignore this menu. All right, so we have this dress. Um, it's a, a Amelia, Amalia floral dress. So it's a sweetheart neckline without any sleeves, of course. Uh, there is a ribbon at the waist to highlight the waist. It's a satin dress with floral detailing, and it comes in 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 16, 18 colors. It's for Altamora, E-body, E-body curvy, classic and curvy, slink, hourglass, and physique, more than likely, because I see slink, but it doesn't say hourglass or physique, so probably both. And then we also have a uh, blazer Matreya. So that is the Malia floral dress. So we have that. And then the next dress that we have is the same dress, but it's called Malia sequinted. It's without patterns. It's a solid color. The bodice has sequins on it, as well as the waistline and the hem. So this is really pretty. If you guys like that, definitely try it on. It's for the same bodies I just mentioned for Beleza, uh, uh, Matreya Mesh, Altamura, E-Body Classic, and Curvy, and Slink. I think it's cute. Like, it's a certain style. Especially the sequence. I like the sequence one a lot better. Alright then, so we are going to go to... 2,000 leagues under the 20,000 leagues under the sea and it looks like they're selling like oh this is fallen gods and libertines so let's see one of my subbies has asked me to do a video on fallen gods because uh the people who buy this man's stuff like they are absolute fans like they love him they think that he's great but not only that he's a little sick right now so he hasn't been in sl often so, um, one of my subbies asked me to really highlight his work and his contribution to the fantasy community. I'm working on it. I need to get some more information. If you are watching this video, um, hold on a second. Let me find out who it was exactly. And you could friend me in world and like, tell me about him and tell me, like, show me some of the Sims where people are using his items so I could do a comprehensive video. I would love to do it, but you have to like help me out because I don't know much about the fantasy roleplay Sims. So, like, where the Tinkies and Fairies are, or where we have, like, Fallen Gods. Like, I don't know, guys. So, if you want me to highlight this creator and, um, you know, just wish him well, because we know that he's not doing well right now and he hasn't been in Worlds, I'll also look for people in the group to do this with, uh, to help me out. But um, I, I've heard your call. I'm listening. I'm going to take care of this, but I just need to organize it a little bit better. Okay, so one of the items that are for sale here at Fallen Gods and Libertine is this Bi Bibliothique Delight, and it looks like it includes open and closed with paper books, one to two land impact each, two different frame pictures, and it's copy and modify. So these are the frame pictures. There's some like really old books here, 20,000 Leaves Under the Sea, and that's what there that is here. Then we have this marquee sort of uh, lounger chair, and it comes in all these different colors. It looks like a deep, rich, luxurious velvet color. And it is 10 prims, 11 custom texture sets and unique designs, hand-picked animation and poses from the best SL creators. Um, it's mature only, it's safe, and it has 32 single sets. Why is it mature only? Okay. All right, then we have the peacock curtain and paneling. All right, I need to come out a little bit. Okay, let's go back in. Peacock curtain and paneling. All right, it's copy mod, no transfer mesh, and it is. It looks like one land impact, and the side panels are five land impact. So if you guys are interested in that, go pick that up. It's behind me, so we'll take a closer look at this stuff as well. And then we have green brocade rugs, also available in Marquise full set. It doesn't say how many land impact it is, but I'll click on it and let you guys know. 
And then we have the Fallen Royal Table. Oh, this is a table, huh? All right, and then the table's one land impact. It's copy and modify. And then we have the Abstain Absteen posters. You guys know it's that weird drink with the worm in it. Um, it's copy, modify, no transfer, texture changes. It has 10 different brands, and it's one land impact. All right, so here's the rug. The rug is beautiful. Um, it gives you like that old library, uh, old money, antique -y feel. It's only one land impact for the rug. Here is the lounger. Okay, so if you guys like that. I wish there was like more pattern texture on the arms of the chair. I have to tell you that. So I'm going to sit here, but it, I'm sitting so awkwardly. Okay, there we go. So the, it says the animations were handpicked. So let's go to Marie, Serena, Valeria, Rogue, Catherine. We recognize some of these poses. Suzanne, even though they have different names, Amanda wrapped and let's go back um and then there are some male sits so it's only like cuddles i mean regular sits no cuddles no sex and then we have the poster here i think the poster is really nice i actually will buy this oh i have to use i would buy the poster like i think the poster would look nice in my home so i'm with it i like it a lot and then this is the table Okay, so that's the design of the table. Let, let you see the top of it. Uh, the table looks a little primmy to me, I'm not going to lie. So it's one land impact. And then we have the books, the 20,000 Leagues Under the Sea. Uh, and then some of the framed pictures, like the old artwork, if you're interested. It looks like your grandfather or someone gave it to you or you got it from an estate sale. There's some of the pictures. So here are the panelings. And then these are the curtains. The curtains are a little primmy too. So the only thing I personally really love, I don't mind the books, um, but I do like the posters. So I'll grab the posters. Um, let me grab that. Uh, the books I need to think about a little bit, but I don't mind it, but I'm not in love with it either. So that's my honest opinion on this. And um, we're going to move on to the next door. All right, so thank you, Fallen Gods, for sharing some items. I know some people, they'll love everything. Uh, I wish I saw the other picture frame, but that's where we are here. Those are the rugs, the paneling, the posters. Table. We just went through all that. Oh, and there's the vases. I didn't see, like, the... Oh, there are the vases. Okay, so let's see what the land impact on the vases are. Four. So it says four land impact. And so it's unexpected return um, serves vases. Uh, I'm going to go to the, let me just go to the photo so I can read this really well. Includes three vase options, rose textures, changes to seven colors, and it's one to four land impact, modify, copy, no transfer, um, materials enable, and you could copy this. So you can put tons of these vases all over your home. The vases are not bad either, and it looks like it has like uh, some artwork in the center of it. So if you guys like that, you could definitely go pick that up. So that's that. All right, so we will head over to Moo right now. I feel like Mood allowed us demos, but we couldn't try it on last time we went to the store. All right, so here we are at Moo. This Secret Sale Sunday item is never right here, so I have to look for the beam. There's the beam. Let me run, run, run. Run to the beam. I can't sing yet. I'm always trying to sing. It's like really sad. It's really sad or it's like, aw, good for her. So we have the Kim Romper here. It's backless. Ooh, sexy. And then we have the scallop edge, um, kind of scallop edge on the shorts. It's really high in the back. And then it's like this um, high neckline that with high sleeveless, high crew neck neckline, but it's seamless. Then the crew neck is held on by a string. So this is for classic Maitreya, physique, hourglass, Isis, Freya, Venus, and tonic. So that's the Kim Romper. It is only 50 lindens. If you guys are interested, please go pick that up. 
Next time I come here, I'm going to go to the fortune teller kiosk. Let's see what they have to tell me. Now we're going to go over to Tyler's treasures. Tyler's treasures. Like, this is a store that we go to, or at least I go to, and, um, you know, I'm not sure about them, but then I look at the actual product and I'm like, hmm, the, you know, they've got something here. That's how I feel about Tyler's Treasures. All right, so I'm just going to go through the picture to make sure I, I go through everything here. Okay, we have more curtains, curtains, Brielle Planter. All right, so just make sure I, I've got everything. All right, and we're, okay, I see it. I see it. All right, so we have... The Brielle Bench Bento Cuddles Bench, animated with two slow dances, six bento couple cuddles, sequence plus sequences, six male and female bento singles plus sequences, and seven colors for the pillows and three wood colors. So we'll look at the furniture itself. Itself, the seven the texture changes include seven pillow changes and three wood texture changes. So if you guys like that, I'll let you know what the land impact is on that shortly if it's out. Then we have Brielle shelf with decor. It's three color texture changes for the wood. So I need to look at the mesh on that one. Oh, there it is, right there. So I love the design on the elephant. Number one, number one. Let me go in and out, in and out. I want the book to rest. So the shelf itself is going to be five land impact. It's not terrible. All right, not terrible. And here is the bench. And it says that we could change the texture of the wood. I don't know if that's dark wood, light wood. So we have three baskets here. We have the bench and we could change the pillow textures. Okay. Then we have our Brielle plant. And it says uh, three change textures on the wood as well. So there we go. All right, so let's move off the way. So this is the Brielle plant. The plant is not bad. I don't know about the soil, the texture of the soil, but everything else is not bad. All right, and so Tyler's Treasures is also selling some curtains. Black and gold pattern drapes, double-sided. Gold and white brocade drapes, double-sided as well. And then we have the Spring Butterfly Garden with Watering Can. Okay, so let's go look at the curtains really quickly. The curtains may be resized, and if you resize it, it changes the land impact. But at this size, the land impact is only three. The mesh is not bad. The texture is not bad. It looks kind of nice. Let's see if we can find the watering can up front, because that's generally where they put that sort of stuff. Mm -hmm. Oh, look at this. So this is the gold brocade. I like the gold too. Let me see up close. Hmm. I'm tugging. I'm I'm struggling a little bit because I'm like, is this primmy or is this nice? I don't know. I always feel the same way about his stuff. And this is the watering can. So let's go back to the description of the watering can. So we talked about the planter, we talked about that. So spring butterfly watering can includes three animated fluttering butterflies, butterflies, lights on the water twinkle. So the water twinkle, okay. So that's what that is. It's just showing the lights is on. I don't see the butterflies fluttering, but this is what it looks like. So if you need some landscaping items, there you guys go. Tyler's treasures. All right, so let's head on to the next door. Is this our last one? Oh, we got to go to 13 Act. Okay. Okay, so let's head on to the store. They have a few items. We should be nearing the end because this video is typically not this long. It's about an hour long. All of these event videos kind of are because it's just, it's a lot of stuff that we have to get through, guys. And then it doesn't help that I lollygag and talk and look at all these different things. All right, so for the Secret Saturday sale, we're at Mystique Bloom. And let's see what they're selling in terms of dresses. So we have this, um, okay, what's the name of this dress? The sign is blocking it. Rose and lace peach dress, okay? And it is for tonic, fit mesh, 
Beleza Mashbadi, uh, Matreya Mashbadi, Slink Hourglass and Physique. So it's this long romantic sort of dress and it has lace detailing at the top and lace detailing at the hem and sort of pleating. If there were demos, I would try this on because I'm just curious to see what that would look like. And then we have the Nadine dress. It has like a wide 2000s double, <laughs> double buckled belt. It's sleeveless with the ruffles and it's asymmetrical. This is giving me like 2000s rainbow vibe for sure. And then we have like this uh, 50s housewife halter dress except it's brown and it's called the leave dress. It's for the same bodies I mentioned before, fit mesh, except that it is also for e-body classic and e-body curvy. So e-body users, like come check out this dress if you're interested. It's like one of the few modest outfit items you could probably get. It's for tonic, blazer, matreya, slink hourglass, and physique. Then we have the same dress in purple, which is very nice. And then we have our rainbow dress that comes the Nadine pink. It comes in pink. Okay. And then we have the rose and lace dress that comes in blue. I kind of would want to try it on, but I don't want to buy anything else that I'm not going to like because I don't like when that happens. I hate it, actually. So uh, this is what we have for Mystique Bloom. If any of these dress interests you, like certainly pick it up. It's only 50 linen. I feel like I should make an Avi today. I think that Jenna's Lab put out a new bento head. If they did, I'm going to definitely make an Avi today, and I'll get it like a slink body or something. I'll make an Avi today. I feel like it. All right, so we're at the, we're going to 13 Act, and this particular sim shares a, a, this sim with Triggered and Pooey. Triggered and Pooey is often part of my um, 50 Linden sale. No, 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 no. Happy hump day sale. Sorry, guys. Sorry. I was getting a little confused. All right, so 13 act. Which way are we going? So here. But where's this Saturday? Okay, this is it. Secret Sunday, right? Yeah, triggered. No, 13 act. Because they have the HUD here. Where's the HUD for... Uh-oh, this is getting confusing. Okay, so this is Triggered Store. Is it in the store? I see this girl looking at something. What is she looking at? Nothing. They, it's so interesting that they share a sim because they all sell really similar items. All right, so let me just close this out. I'm going to see if I can find... Um, So these were part of gotchas, sales. Oh, there it is. Okay. So let me just pay and just make sure it's okay. 50 secret sale Sunday. Is this a secret sale Sunday item too? Yep, it is. Okay. So let's look. So this is from 13 Act. It's a collar. So it's, and it was also on sale for the hump day sale. So if you guys watch my videos, it's quite likely that if you liked it the first time you may have got it but if you missed it for the hump day sale you, there's another opportunity to get this for the secret sunday sale so it's neon glowing heart and it blinks um it's unrigged unisex and resized by click so that's the collar um i i don't think it says collar but i'm not sure that it's rlv i can't tell it doesn't say that in this ad and then we have the 13 act uh six horns and it's neon glowing hearts blinked unrigged unisex resized by click okay maybe okay and i'm going down here because usually they have like the item out on a mannequin so here we go so we're gonna get really close this is what blinks the hearts and there's like a septum ring on the horn that blinks as well so if you guys like this uh this is where you could pick it up 50 linden for the horns 50 lindens for i would say it's more of a choker because i don't think it's rlv but they call it a collar so if you guys like that go pick that up okay so we have the easter teacup husky puppy so let's check that out that is at the cookie jar We have a bunny planter. Okay, so we'll just go through all this, okay? 
Let's just go through on this. I'm not going to show you their other weekend sales. I show you every single week, so you should know by now. All right, so we have the uh, Forest Bear Pound, and it's 11 prims. It's not giving, and it has ambient sounds, and I hope it's out because that way we get to look at it. Then we have a Bunny Planter. It comes in white and pink. Uh, it's three land impact each with some flowers here. Uh, it's a decor item, materials enabled. Then we have a birdhouse tree decor. It looks really flat in terms of mesh texturing. And it comes with some birdhouses, some like, um, you know those tulips that you just like stick in the ground decor items? And it's seven land impact. So there we go there. And let's see the last one is the Easter teacup husky puppy, six prims. And these are all decor items. So let's just zoom in. So this is, oopsie. This is what the teacup husky looks like. You just plop it in front of your ground, in front of your house, or anything like that. It's just for show, guys. Um, this is the birdhouse design. It's probably my birdhouse tree decor, which is probably my least favorite. But it's just not my personal aesthetic, but you guys could love it. And I think the best would probably be the white and pink bunnies as decor items. So if you guys like that, definitely go get it. Uh, you know what? Where is that forest? Pot? Like, I feel like that one would be so important to see because it's such a large item. Like, you don't want to purchase something and get your hopes up and say, "Ooh, I'm going to put this in my yard and then it looks like crap. But uh, I don't have it. So if anyone in our group actually has it, please let us know in the description box in the comment section below because that way maybe they can like send you a gyozo of it you know let your name know be known in worlds and you get a gyoza don't worry about people like inundating you with ims and stuff because everyone knows my name and no one like just very few people i am me so i wouldn't worry about that so leave it in the comment section below and maybe you know you can make a friend and visit the person's sim and actually see it firsthand I, I dated someone who did that. Like, he was very, like, he had, like, this whole stringent policy on buying things. Like, he wouldn't buy anything unless he read reviews. And then after he read the review, he would ask a person in the group if they had it. He'd go visit it. He'd sit on it. He was so particular. I, I just don't even know where he got that energy. But that is, yeah, it, it doesn't hurt, especially for something like that. So we have, who? what is this called? Jono Ariel, and we have 100% mesh jeans, tights, and then um, a crochet top. What bodies are this for? Crochet top bonus, and it looks like it's for mesh, uh, Matreya mesh, Isis Freya for Blaze and Hourglass. All right, so if you guys have a demo, I will try this on for my peeps because I love them so much. I don't need the location. All right, so let me try this on for you guys. You guys could figure out whether or not you like it. So let's try on the jeans for Hourglass, and then we're going to also try on the top. And I am going to take off this set. It's like Serena set or something like that, whatever it is. So let's take off this boho top and these shorts. I love shorts. And then you guys can see what this looks like and give me your opinion. So it looks like, it says the top is a bonus, but... Yeah, so it's 50 linden for the top and 50 linden for the jeans. So let's check this out, guys, on my body. So this is what the crochet top looks like. Don't mind this hair base situation. Oh, so annoying. It's so annoying. When you wear doe hair, I don't know why this keeps happening with doe hair, but if you wear doe hair uh, in a hair base, this is the struggle that you have to deal with. Like, you think you're looking all cute, and then you realize that you're looking a hot mess. I think I would like these jeans better as tights. Like, I could do better without, I, I could do without the waistband and things like that. So, this is what the jeans look like. There are tons of different HUD options and colors. All right, so let's circle around my body. It looks good on my body, though. My butt looks good. But I don't like the paneling in the jeans, the waistband, and where the zipper is. And this is the crochet top. Uh, the material of the crochet top, um, I don't think I'm a fan of that either. But this is what the outfit looks like. If you guys like it, definitely go pick it up. Let me back out of myself just a little bit and then cam back in. 
and I have to be careful because I'm going to be naked in five minutes. So this is what the outfit looks like. Maybe it'll look better in different colors. Like, I'm not sure about the black. I do like the strappiness of the back of the top. But, so let me know what you guys think. Um, I wonder if there's a HUD where I could change the colors. Oh, there's a top HUD. All right, so let me change the color of the top. Please don't get naked. And uh, maybe I'll go for white. And I just want to see if it still gives me like that flat sort of plastic texture feel that I was getting with black. It doesn't. I think it looks actually better in white. So this may look better in different colors. The top may look better in different colors. I will probably get the top. I wish it was a fat pack. But I'm still getting that I'm still getting that like weird texture feel with the um, olive green. I think the white is okay. What, let me know what you guys think. Anyways, I don't want to do too much. So there's also a solid color HUD for the jeans. There's multi, there's ombre colors, print colors, and all these other colors. So this outfit's going to disappear off my body, and I don't want it to. So I'm going to be safe rather than sorry. And I'm going to put on my Serena Boho outfit on now. So let's put on my hourglass top and then my hourglass shorts and then if this outfit disappears it disappears <sighs> all right so that's what we have here so if you guys like it go get it and these are all the colors of the tops and all the pants colors whether it's ombre solids prints and that's it all right, so now we're going to go to 1975 because we have a brandy flask that goes around the neck. So let's go check that out. 1975 is a regular on this list. All right, so let's check that out. I haven't bought anything here yet. Since 75, this is what it says, and it's a necklace that you wear, kind of like dog tacks, except it has like a brandy flask on it. Uh, and yeah, so if you guys like this, go check it out. I wish they would put their items out because it's hard for me to tell if I'm gonna like it or not. That's my issue with this. I, I just don't know. Uh, it's not my style anyway, but for a guy, like I think a guy would like this, but it's unisex, but we just need to like see it. All right, so we're going to go to Amadorus Home and Furniture. It looks like the cookie jar, too, so let's see. Why not Home and Furniture? So that's where we're going. Amadorus is the name of the land. Wow, look at that gazebo. How pretty is that? All right, so... Okay, let's... Where's the beam of light? There it is has the whole playground and everything so it must be in the store I feel like we went in here to look at that L-shaped sofa okay and just if you guys there's some it looks like gotcha for like a dining room set a kitchen set things like that so if you guys want to play gotcha and take some risk go ahead then why not gotcha all right, so here we go. This is the secret Sunday sale item list. <clears throat> and then we'll walk in the store. I'll see if I can find it. Because that's what I did last time. That seemed to work fine. So we have the Why Not. Ignore this. Why Not in Versanda patio set. It says texture change chair, cushion, and resible res propped table. Um, and this would be the table. And then there's like a little fire pit there. Then we have a Why Not Carydale Coffee Bar in Warm Wood. Okay, that's cute enough. And then we have Why Not uh, Strata Carol Patio set in yellow. And it says texture changes, lampshades, texture change to the lampshades, 
touch lighting and trellis lighting okay so if you like that then we have the why not santa armchair in red 30 to 60 second looped animation with props male and female we have the matching sofa 30 to 40 second looped animation with props couples and females and then we have animated for three kids playtime collection rocket slide so um, in case you don't know, Why Not has furniture for kids. That's what um, it seems that we're getting at here. Let me see if I could find any of the items. So we had uh, kind of like a bar set, right? Where would I be able to find that here? I need a kitchen too. The load is really weird on this furniture. Okay, they have some old group gifts too, like artist set, different things like that. So if you guys want to check that out, like, especially if you don't have money, guys, if you don't have money and you want to just like, you know, update your sim, please take advantage of group gifts. Um, and maybe you have like a really low budget, like just take care, take advantage of group gifts, guys. Don't make yourself crazy. Like you don't have to shop every sale. All right. So I found the chairs, the red sofa chairs. So this is what it looks like. Let's wait for it to res. So we have the Santa sofa in red and the Santa sofa armchair. And this is what it looks like, guys. This is what the texture is. Ooh, all my booty. So th the red items are in sale. So we found that. Okay. And I'm just trying to see. Uh, I think that's good enough. If we can't, I wanted to really see the coffee bar, but... I, I just don't know where it is and I don't want to run around for a long time because this video is already at an hour and 30 minutes. Yeah, so that's going to be have to be good enough for now, guys. Let's see. Lounge, beach and garden. Or even that yellow sort of patio set I would have liked to see. There's a bike here. I'm just going to walk down, just, I'm curious. Okay, so we found one more thing. So I did a good job. I'm doing decent by you guys. So here's the second thing that we found. We'll wait for that to res. I like the fire and smoke texture, not so bad. All right, so this here is going to be the Inversanda patio chair. So we have that here and then the resible prop table. So you guys can look at that as well. Okay, so this is also 50 London. So if you guys are interested in that and you want to just update your beach area, you can use this. And the texture changes cushion back and seat. All right, so let's just change that to, I don't know, a deep blue. Let's change this to deep blue. Deep blue. So you can change it so it doesn't have to change the aesthetic to match your home. So this is really cute. It's only 50 Linden on sale. I kind of like it. I don't mind it. Uh, so I just wanted to throw that out there. So we found two items so that you have an idea of, you know, their texturing and mesh quality. So that's the armchair. We did all that. I would have liked to see this, this patio setting yellow. All right, so now we're going to head over to look at, we're going to um, Sweet Kisses. I hope Sweet Kisses is not the name of the, and we'll find out shortly. So we're going to Cloth. Sweet Kisses is the name of the, um, the sim, whoever rents it. All right, I feel like we've been to this store before, and it may be from Atreya only, but let's see. All right, so we have this turtleneck with a harness. We have this floral mock turtleneck dress. We have this either bathing suit or bodysuit situation here. It doesn't have a lot of descriptions on it. We also have this satin bra with rhinestone outline or design. Okay. And it's also a laggy store, so I can't get rid of the HUD. And then we have this four colored footless socks with the strap at the top. So what I need to find out is who they make clothes for. This is what's on sale. So I'm gonna just go to one of their items and 
uh, I need to hit the demo. So give me one second, because uh, that'll give me an idea of who they're making clothes for. All right, so let's hit the demo and open that up. Give me one second. I'm just waiting for this to, I might have to go to the next spot because it's very laggy here. So laggy, in fact, that it's not even opening. I think all these clothes in the stores for Matreya. I'm almost certain of it. All right, so now we're going to head over to South City. Those items were available at Cloth. We're going to head over to South City, and let's just look at what they're selling this week. We have the Pacifica Chair for Adults. It's copy and modified, two land impact total, 499 linden. Why are they giving us that price? Uh, four texture options, red, gold, and green, yellow, animated and photostatic poses for solos and couples. We have the Pacifica Staggering Shelf, copy and modify, four land impact only, and it's giving us the price of $199. Everything should be $50 lend in here. All right, so let's, let's come out of here. First of all, let's look at the furniture. So this is the Pacifica chair. That's number one. We're going to go into the photos like we normally do, and then we'll go into... So we have the Pie Time Pie Safe set, and it's Pie Safe, all four texture options, it's apple pie, draped pie, and pumpkin pie, and the pies are one land impact each, and it's like a pie chest drawer. And then we have um, the Pacifica Staggered Shelf. I just read about that. We have the Patio Pergola. Okay. Uh, we have the Mission Bed for Adults, 100% mesh bed, 191 animations for solo and couples, 8 finishes on the frame, 8 designs for the duvet, and each sheet, pillow, skirt, and messy version, neat version is going to be 8 prims, okay? We talked about the Pacifica chair, and then this is the Pie Time Baker's Block, where you can actually bake your pie. Alright, so now that we've done that, let's scroll into the bed. Alright, let's put on the messy option. Uh, let's do blue famil, just to give it some, like, like, to make it a little bit interesting. So this is what the duvet looks like in blue famil. Um, it's just like a really basic bed. And if you buy this bed, it is 50 linden, um, and you have adult poses on it. Uh, let's try patchwork. Okay, this is what the shelf looks like. The Baker's block with the pie, not so good, but I think the cabinet is okay. So you guys, it depends on what your taste is and what you like. Uh, is this animated? No, it doesn't look like it. So that, that over there is the patchwork quilt. I wonder if you could change the wood. It doesn't look like it. Okay, so I'm actually sitting. I thought it was going to be animated where you can, like, roll out the pie dough. So this is what that looks like. So if you guys like that bed, like, definitely be sure to go pick that up. All right, so next thing we're going to do is I want to go a little quickly because we're at one, one hour and 36 minutes and my storage space won't allow for too much more of this. So I want to make sure we get through everything. And this is quite a lot this week. All right, so we're at Daglet and there are some female poses. And it says Hopscotch, which is the name of the store, offers a wide variety of single poses and pose props, also offers couple poses, everything you need for your photographic needs, and just for fun in life. All right, so there we have that. So we're going to go check out some poses. Um, it doesn't look like there are any sample poses out. So, And they are, they've been at Pose Fair. So um, here we have some male poses. It says Friday Night Male Poses. We have Friday night female poses. It's like some coquettish, flirty poses and stands. Okay. And the guy's like, hey, you want me to buy you a drink? Like that kind of pose. And that's 50 linden. Then we have stepping stone flowers and shapes, texture changes, plain, mossy, and four option colors for only one land impact. And um, what is this other stepping stone? And this is stepping stone flowers shape two. They look very similar. Just one is more spaced out and one's more cluttered. So that's the difference, and that's going to be 50 linden if you guys are interested in that, either the poses or the stepping stones. All right, so what is this next door? Foxborough or Star Sugar? Star Sugar. 
Okay, star sugar. Okay, so this is star sugar. They're new to the 50 Linden Secret Sale Sunday. So let's see what they're selling us. I, I don't know where okay so the hut is here so what are you guys selling so the hut is here let's see what they're selling house bed and stairs that's a lot of stuff okay let me see what is going on here so maybe we can't see it So it's house bed and stairs. It says three separate parts. House bed, cover, stairs, combined shelf. The bed is nine land impact. The bed covers 12 land impact. And the stair shelf is two land impact. Uh, I feel like they should actually let us demo this and look at it. I mean, especially if you're selling a large piece of furniture like this. The store looks kind of interesting. Um, what? Did, where do these stairs lead? Okay, can I find the item here? Hmm. There's ghost here. Okay, um, yeah, so that's what they're selling here. So if you guys are interested, uh, go check that out. I personally would not buy anything without being able to see it. So we're going to go to Script Molly Lingerie, Strip Molly Lingerie, and basically it's one of those touch strip lingerie items. And this is being sold by Yoko. Yokai Samari. So let's check this out. Okay, so it looks like they're selling two items. So we have this strip lingerie. It's from Matreya Legacy Slink Physique and Hourglass. And all you have to touch, and then the boobs are out. And then we have the Camille stockings from Matreya Legacy. It's um these thigh high stockings all lace with satin ribbon so if you like guys like that and it's for your body definitely check that out as well and then we have nipple jewelry with needles Ooh, that looks painful and it looks like it's from matreya uh let's go look at that at felicita's design or is that the name of the land i'm sorry this is from zephyr sweet lady shops it's very confusing. They have to like make, they have to put their logo and make it very clear. So I'm assuming the item is going to be on this wall. So there are three items. I'm sorry guys, I can't tour the store and anything like that because we only have, I probably have 20 minutes of record time. If I do happen to cut off, thank you guys so much for watching. You can look at the rest of the HUD on your own. Please be sure to like and subscribe if you want me to continue feel, filming the Secret Sunday sale on the weekends. So we have the Nikita body. It says undress me. Owner menu includes opening at the bra, the JJ ass and access and you can have access to um, groups, everyone or no one. Um, then we have the lingerie, which is Bella. Uh, it has some pasties at the boob, and it's just chain, chain lingerie. You can either put the pasties on and off to hide the nipples, and um, there we have that. And then we have the nipple jewelry with needles. That looks really painful but beautiful at the same time with the pearl uh, bra, but it's out. Like, there's no covering at the breast area. It's needle ad menu, public, no one in group. So I guess it's interactive and add to each nipple either one or two needles. Okay. Okay, and that was the last door, so we're done. So guys, thank you again so much for watching um, and bearing with me. This was a really long um, kind of shopping haul this week. Um, please be sure to come back, like, um... Yeah, be sure to come back, like, subscribe, and share it with whoever you think may be interested. I love you guys so much for watching. Have a great day. Bye.